Welcome to Art with Cork. And remember, we can all be artists. And if you're not making mistakes, you're not learning. Okay, guys? You're just doing something. All right, guys. I'm starting this picture off with just two circles colored in um, with my black marker. And we're going to draw gumball. Okay? We're going to work around these two dots. So draw that in right now. All right, and then we're going to add Gumball's eyes in. He's got great big eyes, so we're gonna take, we're gonna draw a great big circle. Okay, and then we're gonna come on the other side and draw another great big circle. All right, and he's got great big bushy eyebrows, so we're gonna take, draw a line like this, and another line like that. Curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, and then you're going to connect these through. And then you're just going to color these in. Remember, guys, when we're working and it's going too fast for you in this video, all you have to do is hit that pause button. All right, we're going to color over here. Looking good, guys. All right, we're gonna come right over here. We're gonna draw in his mouth. It's gonna be a great big oval like this. And in the middle of this oval, we're gonna draw his nose. All right, you're gonna draw a letter U. Let's color that U in. All right, draw a line. All right, we're gonna have Gumball talking to us. So let's drop his mouth open. It's just a great big U shape. And then draw another U shape. And then let's draw a tooth in right there. How about that? All right. And then let's color in this back part of his mouth. Everything except for the tooth and the tongue. Later on when you're done, you're more than welcome to color this in. Maybe make a background for Mr. Gumball here. There you go. Ooh, he's looking like Gumball. All right, friends. Now... We're going to come in right here, and we're going to draw his cheek in, and you're going to make a curved line all the way back to under his chin right there. All right, and then we're going to come up on the top. You're going to make a curved line right over his eyebrows, just a little bit above his eyebrows. Curve him around. Curve, curve, curve even with that last line. I'm draw these little lines. They represent his whiskers. We're going to come right up here now and we're going to draw one of the ears. And in the middle, draw another ear. All right, and then draw a line down, down. All right, and then from this point, we're going to draw a line across for the shirt and another one. All right, and go to that second line right here. Draw this in a triangle, but stop. Don't connect the triangle, okay? All right, let's do that same thing on this other side. Go out and then stop before you connect your triangle. All right, now go up to this top line right here, and we're going to go. We're going to draw another triangle outside of it, but curve it on the outside this time and stop. Same thing, another triangle, curve it, don't make a point, and stop. All right, let's make a loop and come over here and make a loop. Okay, and then we're going to go bump, 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 and then just draw these lines on down. And then we're going to come over here and we're going to go bump, bump. Boom, and connect, and you can kind of draw those lines on down. All right, and then go right below his hands here, and you're going to draw a curved line, just connecting those lines. Right from here, from his two index fingers, just draw a straight line. And let's draw his belt. And then in the middle, you're going to draw a straight line going down, but not all the way down to the bottom. All right. And then you're going to come right here, match with his body right here. Again, match with the 
body so that everything's the same length okay and then you're going to take and we're going to go right here and we're going to draw a loop going that way we're going to come over here and draw a loop going that way and then draw a curve line at the bottom curve line at the bottom and then we're just going to draw these curve lines in here like that so it represents his toes and then just connect right there and there you go with his feet and right down here draw this big loop for a tail and guys that is almost it wait I almost left something out let's just draw these little curved lines at the bottom and then right over here let's draw two curved lines here and here and guys that is absolutely it I hope you enjoy drawing gumball you could after the video color it in uh, maybe make some patterns in the outside Thanks for tuning in. Have a great day.